Welcome to some Be Open here on week 13, but it is not your standard week 13 fair. It is some official racing because, of course, the real NASCAR season goes on as scheduled even through our iRacing week 13. So we've got our uh, normal good old Be Open here, one of the few things that is remaining normal <laughs> this week. Um, we're going to jump out for qualifying here with our OSR setup. We do have a qualifying setup again this time. And uh, it is very sketchy. I almost considered just putting the race setup in just because it's so hard to drive. But very clearly there's speed in this thing if I can hold it together. So I'm, I'm going to go for it. And by that I mean I'm going to take it kind of easy the first lap and then go for it for real on the next lap. But it's really loose on these cold tires for sure. Really wants to spin out on you. We'll see what we can get. Mm, overdrove it there. That's unfortunate. One more lap. Yeah, I don't know. Very hard to be consistent with this thing without it wanting to just completely kill you. The guy behind has just done a twenty-seven point four. Okay, that was a much better turn that time. We'll see if we can manage to slow down well enough for this corner. Okay, that was pretty decent. That's fine. I'm okay with that. 27-2. We'll take that. Uh, I don't know if it's going to be good or not, but it should be serviceable, I hope. I'm not going to feel too bad about qualifying behind the number one. He's got like 8.8 case uh, I rating. So, uh, yeah, that's fine. If he's a couple tenths faster than me, that's just fine with me. It's like we're ahead of a nice number of people, which is good. We'll just have to remember to throw in our race setup. And uh, I'm going to try a practice pit stop real quick. So I think when I, when I do my pit stop, I'll be low line this corner. I'll shift to third. And right about that yellow line. That should do well enough. I'm okay with that. I'm a little nervous because Phoenix is tough. This is a tough racetrack. And uh, it can be messy here on iRacing, just because it is tough. And you got people uh, entering the corner low and having trouble holding their lines. And you, this can be, unfortunately, a bit of a wreck fest sometimes. I'm hoping that's not the case here. We'll uh, hopefully uh, be able to avoid anything coming our way. We are the number four car for this event with our 4.9k. Oh, we just lost two spots at once right there. That's fine. We're still ahead of a good number of people. Not going to be too worried about that. 27.2 is just about as good as I was hoping for. I'll definitely take it. So that's P7. I think I would rather start on the inside. But if we've got that crazy dog leg that we're going to have to take. And uh, I will be taking it often enough. You just you kind of have to. You're leaving way too much time on the table if you're not going to be using the dog leg, I think. With this layout of the track. The one is going to qualify first and then just not do another lap, I guess. I don't know why people do that. They get their pull time and then they just don't run a second lap and everybody has to wait. But we were going to have to wait anyway in this case because we've got plenty of people still working on it. But only 20 or so seconds to go. So that's okay. So we got some strong drivers in here. We got the 8Ks, the 5Ks, 27 cars. And the lowest is a 2.3, which is still pretty good, obviously. So 3.1K strength of field. 
Should be tough competition. Hopefully guys will keep it together. What we got around us? Is that a license? That's the end of the session. Seventh position. Right, someone else just qualified right behind me, I think. Yeah, we got so we got some good A class drivers around us, hopefully able to keep it together. I was worried I was gonna see like a B one point two or something, you know. <laughs> That's always a little concerning. But Looking good, looking good. We got ourselves a P7 qualifying position. We changed our setup to the race setup. So let's hop on in, huh? We don't have the data. Root chief's ready in case we do have a long run. I hope we do. That'd be fun. I haven't really looked at this new auto fuel thing yet. So I'm going to turn it off because I already have a fuel calculator. Margin lapse. Okay. Interesting to give you a little bit of buffer, I suppose. We already have a fuel calculator and I hope it did the update didn't break it. We'll have to just keep an eye on it. Oh, three sets of tires. So we'll have to use those smartly. Cuz I can definitely see a case where we uh how did everybody up, like the new light models? End up using those up really quick. I haven't tried it yet. I have not tried the late model yet either. Um, sounds like they have a whole lot of grip. <laughs> I'll give them a try soon enough. I was actually going to do a Formula Ford race here, but this was going off first. Before the Formula Ford race. So they have like the Battle of the Little Wings, I think. We're getting new Barca bodies here before long. That too, yeah. <laughs> they're all, they're just bringing you all the news. We've been hearing that for years. That's true, though. They definitely they straight out said it that they were going to bring new Arca bodies since we now have Gen Four, which is also going to be brought up to what they called um, current standards or something like that. <laughs> so um, those things are going to get attention, which is really cool. Follow car number zero. Six, Some exciting six, developments six, that uh, no one really even expected at the start of uh, this week 13 because none of it was really planned. It was that mistake with the ARCA car, you know, breaking the uh, limiter, I guess, and adding extra horsepower in it and then uh, sending it out. <laughs> So now we're going to have ourselves a Gen 4 series. Ready, going green. I forgot how soon the green comes out here. Got to pay attention now. Okay, we'll have a Gen 4 series with the Arca body, essentially. And then the old Arca car will still be around. I cannot see. Got to focus up right now. I'll talk more about the stuff we learned later. Sorry about that, I'm sleeping. Car outside. Now. Easy now, cold tires. Stay low, there is a car on the high side. Clear high. Slow it down. Outside, clear. Someone's using the apron, that's interesting. I'll be that guy, I guess. Gotta be careful, because the Xfinity car, it can get loose down there, so I will have to watch out for that. For sure. I want to slow down more for this corner. It feels like I'm overdriving here. I want to get it down to this yellow line as much as possible. Try not to overdrive this thing. Gets loose out of this corner for sure. Session last lap up. Sixth place. The lap time was 27.6. New fastest lap from Perry, 27.5. 
Very difficult to figure out how I want to drive here at Phoenix. It's difficult to say, like, am I overdriving? Like, especially through that long, winding turn. I guess it would be turn... <laughs> two and three? I always forget the order of the turns now. Yeah, so turn... whatever that is. Turn one? Is that turn one now? That's turn one and two? This place confuses me, man. Gotta be careful. We're running P6 though. Happy with that right now. Jacob, what's your payback? Seventy. You got seventy percent tape. I moved mine to sixty-nine percent from sixty-eight on the standard OSR. All right, this guy's kind of blocking up the bottom here. Kind of broke my momentum. It's fine. Like, uh, most people aren't using that dog leg. I wonder if they know something I don't. Like, it's really bad on the tires or something. Because I know you do have to obviously turn the wheel more to get down there. Seems like most guys are using that, uh, using the actual track. I guess I'll experiment with that next lap. That guy's gone. That's comforting. Is he gone for good, or is he gonna reappear sometime this year? Did we just get fifth place? <laughs> Ooh, we had just nose push right there. That was pretty bad. I guess that guy's gone. I guess we're in fifth now, all right. That's a way to make a pass. Are we, are we losing more? Are we gonna win this race just because everybody else blinks out? <laughs> I mean, that wouldn't be a very fun way to win, but... I guess we just keep it steady right now. We'll, we'll use the track, I guess, like everybody else is, if that's the way to do it. Try not to overdrive. Throwback Kyle Busch behind us is driving in a little harder. I might let him go because there's a gap behind him and I don't really want to get run over. Yeah, there's the official droppage of that guy. That's unfortunate for him. He was the number two as well, so he was going to be hard to beat. Most likely. Lots of guys having internet issues. Sounds like. I don't know, it just feels like a waste not to go down there, right? So we got like three uh, hundredths of a second there. You do that for three laps, you've gained a tenth. You got a hundred lap race here. You can see how that starts adding up, right? Like, I don't know. I mean, maybe it hurts the tires more. That, therefore, it's not worth it, but... I don't know, man. Seems like free real estate to me. Here's a cop. Hey, he just completely plowed, you know. 
Why did the auto fuel turn back on? Take care of him, he says. That's scary. That was a threat. Tommy's been hitting a lot of people this week. I'm going to take some tires. Tommy hit people. All that guy's not. Watch your speed. I don't know why he did not in trouble before. Miles per hour. Okay, Colton. Your engine temperatures are now back to normal. It's time for tires. I feel like. Still on the service. Somebody, somebody hit already. Where did he mad at? Are you in the session? Pit box team ten. Frickin' power park fell out. Three, two, one. Right here. here. Yeah, quite. Is fuel working properly? I hope so. Yeah, worst week ever for me. Tires were not bad, 94, 94. So I guess we're doing an okay job with that. But we are going to take the full four. We're done. And Get it, you going. Get my tires. And it gave me all tires. That's nice. They want you in single file. 2.7 Get close on uh, fuel though. Theoretically. Uh oh, we had a speeder. I didn't expect my car to be so fucking tight, to be honest with you. Save some fuel here. Was that my right front, right rear? 94, 94, 94. That was 92, 95. Sounds like we're doing okay. 94, 94. Deuce trying to make his way back up. What? Uh, whatever. I'm going to take the short way around. Hopefully uh, save some fuel. You never know. Maybe uh, we could save enough to even make it to the end here if we go green. That would be really good. And... Uh, you don't want to be the one that can't make it, so. 2.5 2. short earlier, as of right now. Kind of really went... you never know if I we get another immediate off, caution uh, or something, too. When I, did, I, I think we kind of net coded maybe a little bit. But I got a Go wipe his home. Hi, wife. I didn't get any damage. <laughs> well, you're in. Thanks. Just getting yeah, started. I don't know what the hell Doing okay, though. He drives like a freaking idiot all the freaking time and does shit like that, dude. It's our open. Sounds like they're having issues with yeah, someone I, specific I back there. I don't know. I haven't really been paying attention, but someone that's like been me. a common problem. Uh, Hopefully, we don't find you know, that person. We're on lap 15 or 14 when it happened, and we were running like 13th or 14th. Like, he just. He's going to be on the outside this time, so it's going to be a little bit of a different look. He'll never learn, baby. He'll never learn. I just put it behind We're surrounded by uh, setup shops here. Looks like two teammates maybe on the front row right now. Got a long way to go. Really see who's on the inside there, but we got our single car team. Working on it. Leader did not take tires. Leader didn't take tires. Oh, that's right. The leader didn't take tires. I'm pretty glad we're on the outside then. I'm glad that person reminded me. Not that uh, I'm going to be in his lane anyway, but. Ooh, I missed a shift. That was kind of bad. Okay. Go on the outside here. Ooh. I almost wiggled down into him. I'm glad I uh, didn't do that. Free real estate. All right, Colton. That's <laughs> Keep it up. Yeah, that 16's holding on pretty well. I mean, our tires weren't so bad, but he's gonna fall back almost definitely. Is 
Okay, it's not got quite the grip. Come on down here. I come up on you there, 26. Make sure we don't drift up far too far or anything. Should be able to get around them without too much trouble. I want to push it too hard. Hurt my tires trying to get past a guy that we know we'll be able to pass soon enough. Hey, we're in third place right now. Looking pretty good. We got some assistance from other people's bad internet connection, but it still counts, I guess. They could easily still come back, too, if they didn't lose too many laps and we get some more cautions. So, they're not completely out of it by any means. Long race. I do think it was the right move to take tires. So we have a couple more to spare still, and you don't know if this thing's going to go green for a while. Feeling good though, feeling good. Fun track to drive, though it is uh, pretty difficult to get right. Never feel like I'm racing this place correctly, but we're doing okay, I guess, so. Like, I don't know if I'm killing the tires or what, but that first run we were okay. It sounded like pretty much everybody else had worse tires that at least spoke about it. I heard numbers lower than 94, and we had 94 on the bolt's right side, so I guess that's okay. Got plenty of room behind third place back there. Good to see. Fuel window is open, so I'm thinking maybe we aren't going to be able to make it on fuel. 2.2 gallons. Oh, that's so close, though. That's so close. Estimated about 70. That's so, that's so close. Maybe we start lifting off longer. But, I don't know. Is that even going to, is that going to work for us? I guess we'll just keep an eye on uh, our numbers. Water temperature a little high. Interesting. We'll put this up. I don't think it's going to be an issue, but we'll put it up and see what it says later. 260s. That's a little hot. We'll keep using the dog leg. The shortest, uh, shortest way around, too. Point one, that number is decreasing. Theoretically, it should if our tires are uh, wearing out. It's a bad entry. Sometimes the nose just pushes so bad on the entry of that corner. So, I have to watch out for that, especially if I got someone on my outside. I can't let that happen and push up into somebody. I've seen that a ton of times here. It's happened to me too, having someone push up into me. That time the car felt just enough unsettled, I didn't feel comfortable cutting down there. Just kind of doing what the car wants to sometimes is important. Two point four. Okay, that now it just went up. <laughs> Maybe we can't make it. 
67. So close though. Make me worry that other guys are gonna be able to make it. You just done a twenty-eight point three. Two point four gallons. Okay. Right. Hope that's not too annoying listening to uh his fuel estimates over and over again. That could be very important, so I'm just uh Keeping tabs on it. Got a little bit too low right there. Land, I'm gonna lift off early. Point three. He's on the throttle. Can lift up a lot in this corner, just kind of sail it through, so I'm gonna take advantage of that. These two guys up ahead think they have a little bit more than I do, potentially. We'll see if they fall off on tires or something, but not quite feeling up to their speed necessarily. 17's kind of uh, catching up behind. I don't see that. I'll have to keep an eye on what he's planning to do. That's getting a little bit oversteery. Ah, uh, really? Come on, this is this was really getting fun. To be fair, less cautions than I expected. Like I said, this place can get a bit wreck fest y, <laughs> so to speak. Base car is out. Line up single file behind car number. I think we have to take another set of tires and then, then we have to start making tough decisions on when to take that last set. Because we have to come in right now anyway for fuel. I think so. We'll make it on fuel now. No more drama in that department. Your engine temperatures are looking better now. Look out for the pit speed limit. Look out for the pit speed limit. Okay, Colton, we'll pull you to the end. Is this putting all the fuel in it? Like, I don't know what this thing's doing. Put all the fuel in. <laughs> no speed either. Guess this guy's just gonna go through the boxes. I, I will too then. I'm not getting passed because he's gonna go through all the boxes. 92.91. I'm happy with that. I'll take that. We got plenty of people staying out. That's kind of understandable. Move it, move it. Be mindful, you only have one set of cards remaining. Come out right behind the six. Where's uh, the car? So we're kind of in a bad spot with tires. We have to be very careful with this last set when we take it. Yeah. You got loads of fuel. Plenty of fuel. Okay, we're good. I can't hear that guy. <laughs> He's talking really quiet. Everyone tired? Mine was 393. 393 for him. That's 
95. We're on pace with a couple of the guys around us, so I'm feeling okay there. We are in fifth place, so we had three people ahead, I suppose, did not take tires. Or maybe the three took two tires. Hmm, okay, because he did come into the pits. If y'all could go the whole race without a caution, it would benefit me a lot. But uh, past that point, the 13 and the 1, I believe. We'll try extra hard just for you. Do not have tires. Wonder how that two is doing. If he's uh, gotten his lap back, laps back or not? He's four laps down, so he's got some work to do still. No more worrying about fuel, it's just going to be worried about this uh, last set of tires we have to put on there. Because we, uh, we're not even halfway yet. Do you have a restart zone here? No. no. Restart okay, zones have been disabled, ready. unfortunately. So there were some bugs with them. I enjoyed that while it was a, a thing. <laughs> Hopefully we get those back. Okay, we're gonna go on a straightaway. Has no restart zones. Pretty dumb, but that's fine. It breaks a little bit, I was afraid I was going to get into that three. That's bad idea. Whoever decided to put that three wide was bad idea. Knowing that I'm going to be down there. We're stuck behind this three right now. He's being really slow. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. Stay low. All right, maybe we can get around him. Clear. Like right or wrong. Bit of a slide job there. I drove in a little harder, knowing that I could clear him. All right, well, we're doing okay. We survived all that. 24 fired off pretty good. I don't remember seeing him earlier in the race. I don't, see, uh, I don't remember seeing much of the 15 either, so we'll see what they've got. Yep, no shit. That's something reputation matters. Just breaking the way you race the job. Put him in the wall. I'm not gonna do that because I'm not like the terrible. Who are they talking about? Are they talking about the three? I don't remember having any problems with the three, but I can't hear that guy. And maybe it's just me. Maybe I need to turn my volume up, but. Sounds like he's in a library. So we got some space behind, that's good, especially after how nerve-wracking that start of the run was. We were very close, we had some three wide for a moment that I had to watch out for, heading through the dog leg.
Okay, Colton. Maybe a little bit harder here. I'm going to take a higher line. Thought it could give me a good runoff, but it didn't really even out as well as I'd hoped. I'm going to go back to going low line next lap. Pushing a bit tight, that one. He's on old tires, don't forget. I'm diving in on him. Car outside, outside is clear. Feels good past okay. someone you know is much better than you. <laughs> of course, it's only because of tires right now, though. P4 is a great spot to be in. Happy with that. We need this to go green the rest of the way, though. With our tire situation. I believe. I believe we can do it. Nothing's ever gone wrong by trusting your fellow drivers, right? Nobody's ever been burned by doing that. Ooh, got a little loose on entry there. Drove in a little harder maybe than I should have. Car feels good though. Little bit loose. I'd rather it be that way though. Do we have anything for these guys ahead? The 15 and the 24 really stepped it up this run. The 6 is within sight. He's not too much uh, further ahead than he was last run to us. About a second and a half, I believe it was. Visually it looked similar at least. He might have been further last run. Coming up in lap traffic, that's interesting. Trying to take a wider entry into this corner, I think that helps me out. I think I've been entering a little bit too shallow. Second back to the one, falling off on those old tires. So he's not even going to be coming back to us unless we do a really poor job on the tire saving. Time was We're catching these guys though. We're pretty even with them right now it seems like. Got a little bit loose. The lap time was at twenty-eight point two. That'd be just fine if we finished at our car number P four. That'd be very good. Top five would be. That would be great. Be very happy with that.
Lap traffic up ahead. Leader getting around him. 23. And a very colorful looking car. He's got himself surrounded by lead lap guys. But it looks like he's doing a good job moving it up high. Outside. Still there. Outside, clear. I just realized, where'd my race laps go? When did that go away? <laughs> it was there at the start of the race. I remember because I knew what the strength of field was. Apparently disappeared without me noticing. Uh, weird. Oh well, I, I guess we already got the information I would like to get from that. Like, uh, guys around me, like safety ratings and strength of field and... Uh, kind of know when guys pit. All the information we'd normally get from that. I think uh, we're, we're doing okay. Next guy behind is still the one at a second and a half back. Is this thing going to go green? That would be absolutely fantastic if it did. Still feeling pretty good. It's fine, you got loads. It's fine, you got loads of fuel, he says. Okay, Colton, lap times are pretty consistent. We catching up a little bit to the 24. We did just enter that turn a little harder than normal though. So maybe that's the only reason. Might look that way for a moment. Starting to push it a little bit harder. I don't really know why. <laughs> Car just feels okay, so I guess we'll go for it a little bit. Nothing too crazy. That was just a bad corner, though. I entered a little too shallow. Trying to get on the uh, throttle a little bit harder on exit, though. Maybe even get on that right rear. Alright, enter the middle. Much better corner that time. Kind of still just even with the guys ahead, though. Not really making any progress. I think the one's catching back up to us. Which is a little concerning. So maybe we are being bad on the tires. Of course, someone that with 8,000 plus I rating is always going to be tough to beat, even at, on older tires. Lap traffic maybe in the way of the leader. I think if we get another caution here, we just have to take the last set. Especially if we are going to get longer runs like this, we could very well go to the end. Dude, what are you doing? No, no cautions. No cautions. Get him away, man! What's happening? What if you're almost wrecking people while you're a lap down? You literally almost took out the 17. I'll burst on my hands and torch shooting hand grenades. 
pitting. Pitting. Pitting? You got people pitting? Not sure what that's about. Some people not making them fuel? Rewinding to higher low. Hi. Hi. Now, if you had any common sense, somebody with 30 fresh or what tires on me, you wouldn't even push the issue. You just got. Have... You're an idiot. When your mama dropped you and you were born. Twice. <laughs> What's wrong with this 25? Mm -hmm. Good lord. I got shifting. Yeah, that's why you lapped down, though. Yeah, that's why you lapped down, though. Stay low. If I'm off the pace, why am I burning you? Outside, clear. Team hangs on to us a little bit, but not too bad. Oh, so we do got common sense. Oh my gosh, lap traffic is being scary. Don't ruin this, guys. We have a really good green run going. I need this to go to the end if possible. Car outside. Outside, clear. I am my rear end making me loose. Oh, that's the guy that they're complaining about. Clear. So we'll let him go without much problem. He's clearly got new tires or something. Apparently the one has now reached us again. He kind of snuck up on me. One minute he was a second back and now he's right on my bumper. I'm not going to fight that too hard. Clearly he's got, he's got it figured out. Really wants to get by me. He's trying to set something up. I'm just watching, watching him closely, so I know when he's gonna go for it. Inside. Stay high, there's a car on the low side. Clear inside. Can't get it done there. I don't want to just give it to him necessarily. Not really even fighting him that hard. I'm just uh, making sure I hit my marks and run my line. He hasn't been able to overtake. I made a mistake here, though. He'll get me. Or not? That was actually kind of fast. I don't know why that higher line worked. But... Not times are pretty consistent. Very interesting. This has gotten pretty, uh, pretty wild with these lap cars being all over the place and battling the leader. It looks like that guy might be trouble. I've, heard, I've just heard people yelling at him, and then now I see him battling the leader. So.
car's getting pretty loose overall. It's getting a little tougher to drive. Hands are burning. I'm grabbing the steering wheel too tight. I see smoke. Know <laughs> what that was about? Oh, guy heads in the wall. Man, I cannot get this thing to turn very well into turn four. Drove that. Car's not willing to give me much more anymore. Do we have something for the 24? Thirteen, what are you doing? No, I don't wreck. I want this to go green really badly. You're okay, dude. You're lying down, dude. You just done Yeah, I killed him earlier. He's kind of moving to Kane. Hey, I was going to get an 8x, he's a lap down, and he's like, racing me to the lead lap. Outside. Clear up top. It's really trying to get by me. Oh my gosh, that was really Wait, loose. Dude, I drifted through that corner. <laughs> Things are really a handful right now. That was at there. Worked though. I think fighting off the one might have paid off too, although he might just be letting his tires cool off a little bit to give it another go. I've actually been able to hold him off so far. It's loose. Not a great corner. Fourteen to go. What lane you want me in twelve and eighteen? Yeah, I think the one was just letting his tires cool down because he is on his way again. I think. I had I was asking why we go higher or low, <laughs> but you're already here. Usually the rule is stick to your line. Which is what I did there, but I know some people want to use the high line or the low line, so I'm not trying to This is tough. This is tough though. racing. Dude, why are you racing me so hard? Your lap stick. Lots of lap cards being annoying, it sounds like. Tell you, man, the third team's a moving chicane. Thirteen getting yeah, lots of mentions. Me. Oh, I think it was my bad. And when I raced you, you hit the wall five times, and uh, yeah, I didn't do anything to you. No, I will admit, I kind of fucked the guy on the way back around you, so. I just hope they really, I really, really hope that they keep this green. I know they're having troubles with one another, but I really hope they keep this green because I want this to go to the end. It's 
just right on my rear end, get me loose. He's getting loose and saw. Oh, are you kidding me? We just can't have ourselves without Spanish. It's the two. He's had a bad race. I'm Lee Lapcar, you left down. Dude, I tried to pass you cleanly for like 30 laps on 60 lap old tires, and you just. Dude, just let me go. Like, I would have been 10 seconds ahead of you if you let me go. And then I passed you clean, you got me. Like, I don't get it. I didn't affect your race at all. Is this the end? Yeah, it's near the end of the race. Oh, near. Cool. Yeah, no, we still got some time. And like I said, I did not affect your race at all. I didn't touch you. You didn't lose 18. I got to your outside. Next All corner, right, you're Your engine temperatures are now back to normal. If you can't do that, the leader is That's waiting terrible. Now. Just leave him in the pits. It's fine. You got loads. Well, I don't know why that guy needs to be passing people if he's four laps down anyway, but I don't know the situation. I didn't exactly see. I'm one lap down, and you're putting me into the corner. I'm two down. I passed the leaders. I'm sorry. Five. Like. Three. Eighteen. I'm sorry. I screwed you. But you don't just right pump them into the corner. All right, let's get ourselves a good stop, hopefully. 74, 72. Nice, on the right rear. I like that. Car was uh, pretty tough to drive, but it wasn't bad. You're 11. I'm sorry. I'm moving. I'm moving. All right. Do we we gain a spot here. We beat the 24 out. I'm pretty glad about that. I would like to be P3 on the inside. If possible. No one stayed out for uh, a Hail Mary. That's good. I just hope we make it to the end, though, because this could easily turn into a disaster. Boom, Howard. Of course, yellow. It's alright. Complaining, my brother. Yeah, I'm gonna grab you up there, get there, help you grab fast. I thought, okay, yeah, we'll go high. And blam, Yeah, it's not a big deal. I know I'm five now, but I have no damage. I got disconnected. I took it way beyond him, and I finally was like, all right, I'll just go high. And I get out there, and he just dumps me. Like, I don't get it. Huh. We'll have to see what that looked like in the incident later. Thankfully, our entire decisions did not hurt us too bad. Or at all, really. I think it should be just fine because we had such a long run there. The one's going to beat us now. Oh, no, I can't tell you how much. Almost definitely. Now that we're on equal tires. Considering how. He was nearly beating us with old tires. I wasn't even trying because I knew you were only lap, but I was so much faster. It was. I didn't hate to scream past you, and then you wrecked me. Like, it, I just don't get it, man. It's not a big deal. It's whatever. It's over. Crap happens. Crap happens. Stop talking about it. And again, I didn't do it on purpose. You act like I did it on purpose. No, I'm saying it's worse for you if you didn't do it on purpose. All right, we'll see when the six decides to go. I don't know if he's going to do some early start or if he's going to wait till the corner. Roughly around the actual restart zone. Lots of uh, very open-ended here when you get to start. This is pretty distracting. I'm actually going to... Mute that. Post car is off. Time to do your job. Hang on, we're not going green. Uh, really? Going what are we doing? Up we're not going green. Not going green. Me, I have to let two cars by that was way more than a straightaway behind you than green and all the time you're talking. Let the pipe car by. Oh, jeez. Yeah, so just pull up the two car by and I'm on the freaking back straightaway. I don't even know what the fuck it is. Oh, there you go. <laughs> All right, still having to get things sorted, I guess. 
Okay. No, you're fine. Yeah, I just, that's just weird that I might have to go like, 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 around car by. I'll try this again. Thankfully, it's pretty quick. Let's be negative. Read out. Gotta get behind the base car again. I thought you were letting go, bro. You're still on it. If I would have checked up to let you buy, that would make the car behind me get closer. All right. Going green. Position. Car is off. Time to do your job. Oh my god, don't do that. <laughs> Slowing down below pacing speed a little bit. Okay, we're good. Why is the car so tight? Woo! Felt like there's no grip. Let's go. No green white checkers. Let's finish this thing. Driving in hard. Gonna take the higher line. I think that should be faster for me. Technically was there, but I had a bad car in last lap, so I don't know if that actually was good or not. Got kind of tight. Kind of surprised at how tight the car feels. I guess I got used to how loose it was driving. Oh, come on. Guys at the back are ruining it for us. At least we're not in it, I guess. We got three of these things, too. At least we got the one by us. We knew he was going to be faster, uh, no matter what. At least uh, we got that transactions done without uh, incident. Was that 226 that ran me up into the wall like that? So this is the wreck fest I was kind of expecting from the start. At least we got a lot of long green runs until this point. Got him. Got another one oh, right, we gotta let that uh, lie. Isn't yeah, that a surprise? They can get somebody else. I hate how this track's restart works. Like, I, the leaders were going, so I went to the outside of the guy in front of me. And I got penalized for passing the third screen. It's like, but... What'd you run me up to the wall for, 26? We, we gotta talk about this. I need couples therapy. Any luck in get wearing the monkey rack under yellow. Full course yellow. It's are open. Do it. You're just gonna run me into the wall like that, 26, and we're not even gonna talk about it? Please, 26. He wants to have a dialogue. Yeah, <laughs> out here in and shit. Closed. Pit road is closed. He might not have a mic. I don't think he's talked already. I mean, he overdrives the corner, so I give him the bottom, because he's going to pass me, and he just pushes me up against the damn wall. Don't go above him if he's overdriving the corner. Uh, well, hey, that's the first time I let him pass me. <laughs> Let's finish this race. I feel like I'm pushing my luck, having survived this long. You nailed this restart. I bet you can get back to him. <laughs> All right. Checking for wheel spin doesn't seem to be a thing. Trying to pick fights with everybody or get fights going. I got to see the leader just fine. I want to watch it. So we get us our, uh, get ourselves a good jump. You know what a really good amount of that if you wreck under green. One left to green. Alright. Please let this be the last green white checker. Don't put it behind me. I 
Oh my god. god. Hang on. We're not going really? Going. Not going. You, I, I you can let people by that. without stopping on the track. Back then, I'm going to be in the wrong, and then I'll get suspended from my racing for two weeks because of his stupidity, so, you know. I bet all of y'all scared direct comments. I'm gonna run out of fuel if we keep delaying these greens. Not really, but. Usually run right myself. Hell, yeah, well, I can't get to it. Everybody's Lord, hating on everybody. I just want this pace car to get off the track. Maybe I can pull it into that top five I've been wanting. You delayed the green again. One left to green. That might have been me. I was okay, trying to let everybody buy, but the end of this lap. they didn't seem coming, so I kind of slowed down a lot, and I guess. All right, ahead. let's get this done. Uh, first off the track, so. Yeah, because yeah, you got to stay here for the speed. Hopefully, guy ahead gets a good jump. He was going to get by me in time before the green went out, so. Save me, pal, really. I'm going to catch that under me. Well, it's only let you by at the end there. Stop. It's like the, the same thing as last time, I think, too. Something you can do about it, how the game's still you move. Alright, go, man, go! Man, that outside is not where you want to be. Gotta check up for whatever's happening there. Absolute disaster of a restart so far. Someone just wrecked me. Here. Driving like idiots. Car's broken. Some real stupid moves at the end there, but big race good win. Yeah, we had two acts up in that point too, but oh well. Well, we didn't get our top five, but. He's running good the whole race. What even happened? All of a sudden, I just saw smoke everywhere. <sighs> People started running into we each, each other because they don't know how to drive, but... Race. Not after the race, one straight away. Do it. Do it. On, do it. <laughs> well, at least we got out of the ball. I don't even know what happened yet. I want to... I'm just oh. tickled to death that 26 got, got his, uh... Sorry if anyone heard all the commotion I was doing in the so back. 14 ahead of him. And, uh... Come on, do it. Please. So, at least he apologized. Yeah, um, I don't think it should have come through the audio. Um, Hopefully. Yeah, it should have blinked it out. But... I was making dinner. <laughs> Either way, you got to do that, so it's understandable. So, the seven must have gotten into us. We're going to take a look at that final deal there at the end real quick before we do all of the incidents. Guy had had a terrible start. I mean, just look, he's already a car like behind. Like, I just had to wait on him. And then it's hard to see, like, what's going on down here. I dive it in really hard. And then they start running into each other up here. I'm stuck behind it, of course, and that happens. I'm just going high because I'm freaking scared of everybody. They're running into each other. Well, it all worked out. And we just get hit. 
the eight I mean, is the one who suffers the most. Yeah, if you watch the 26, what he did to me. I expect that, yeah. I got a lot of pain in the look back on this race. Seven says, I don't have triples. I mean, I don't either. You're going to see a lot of it from being in I do have a spotter, though. Entire fucking race, but, but you know. he apologized. It's fine. It was my first race. You should really track. apologize to the eight. He got the worst of it, like I said. Everybody's like, well, yeah, yeah. you should wreck him on the caution. And I'm like, yeah, yeah you know. Yeah. Really, the eight saved me there. Race. I just want to finish good. So he got what he deserved. And then my car's got something wrong with the yeah, steering at this point. Eight? It wasn't turning anymore. Yeah, and the 12 gets by us at the end. We get in 8th place. Sucks. I don't know where that guy's freaking going. He almost ran into me. Like, does he not realize the race is over? I don't know. Yeah, like he's still nah, fully yeah, in it. Like, what are you doing? Just put it in there a the race hard. is over. I burned my right rear off. What was that? What's happening up here? The setup I have this leak is, uh, I mean, it's Oops. a good setup and all, but I just, uh, oh, he I just don't know. KOs himself, I guess. Racing here, I new updated Phoenix. I've been, I've been pretty good. Weird. Last <laughs> but, few times oh, well. I did the update. I, it was my, a good race until it decided to devolve. At the end, but I thought the whole race was going to be like that, so I guess it could have been worse. We get a 4x because that ending. One person in the field got a 0x, and was was he the one that? No, it was the two that exited out. Okay, so only the three goes without. I should have been, but we got ran into, but that's okay. Uh, we'll see the incidents. Starting from the beginning. So lap 121 just does not turn into the corner. So I'm gonna do it again. It's a wall again. Here's a colorful 23. We know he ended up a lap car at some point. That probably didn't help. What was that? <laughs> so this guy doesn't slow down at the end of races or for the corners, I guess. Like, first of all, huge dive. Second of all, not even close to hitting the bottom line when there's a guy on his outside. That was just terrible. That was not good. <laughs> so here's the three maybe blinking out. Does lose connection soon, though. Not too long after this. Twitter word getting the wall again. Man, it's frustrating to run in the top four pretty much the entire race, and then because they can't mount wreck and cause green white checkers, and then people can't contain themselves and be clean. <laughs> like, I don't know. It's frustrating, but we still got eighth. Not going to complain too much. Eight can't hold his line down there. That's what happens a lot here. A lot of wrecks happen because of that right there. Like, guys just cannot seem to figure out how to hold a line down there. It's not even close to the yellow line. And just gets a little bit of wall, not too much. 24, he really got back up. He got up to the front near the uh, end. He got third. I wonder if he made like a, a really smart pick call at some point that really worked out for him. Some wall. Don't need to see more wall from him. I'm gonna move along. Looks like the 22 got it pretty good right there though. That was horrible. I think this is one of the guys they were complaining about. And I can see why. He dives it in, doesn't hold his line, comes up and kills it at nine. Yeah. Just very dirty right there. So back green. 
Uh, he clears himself right across the nose of the three. The three was smart, though, and backed out. Saw it coming. That's how he ended up being the only guy with a 0x. Six, net codes a little bit. 27 turns right into the left-hand corner. That was kind of weird. Must have been something on braking. It got unsettled. Coming over the wall pretty good. Five hitting the wall in front of people. This is after the two has blinked out. They're both going to get in the wall there. Eight's just barely keeping it off the wall. 21 still hitting walls. 24 is gonna... Well, it's hard to say. He's good right there. Uh, they kind of just meet in the middle here. That's kind of hard to say. I think the 26 may have, uh, you know, could have been higher. 24 could have been a little lower. Pretty borderline, like, on that one. Two's just gonna run in back to the 26. No idea where the 26 is going, but he almost killed him. The 11 there. See, the two doesn't need to be here. Like, I know he was saying, like, oh, just let me buy. I'm, I'm going to be so much faster. Like, are you? Because it's lap 36 right here. It looks like he's just getting in the middle of their battle right now. I don't know. Like, there's no reason to even be in there. If you're looking for a lucky dog, you're going to have to avoid contact anyway, or else you're not going to get it. So it's just not a very smart place to be, like, in the middle of a big intense battle anyway. I don't know. Here we've got 26 not holding his line. It's that corner again. It's, it's what always happens. People enter really shallow right here and then it just they can't stick it down there. So he comes up and hits the 12. Now we're under caution again. Weird, half the field's just not going. Wow. That was a slumbering field right there. Leader goes early right here. You can see he's going. I guess it's just a real slow start. Uh, the 27 definitely wasn't paying attention. He's in fourth gear or something. Yeah, look at that. He was like in fourth gear. He wasn't ready at all. Nineteen's gonna wall ride it. Doesn't work so well in this context though, thankfully. Don't really want people going around doing that too much. Twenty sticks, uh well he doesn't really hold it down there too well, but he also didn't actually have someone on the out his outside. I don't know, he did actually. Yeah, he like tries a slide job right here. That's I don't know. Weird racing going on back there. I tries to get below the, the guy ahead, but they're just all tripping over each other. Three pretty hard in the wall. Your leader getting a tiny bit of wall. Moving right along. Probably don't need to see all these wall hits. Trying to go a little bit faster until we see some side by side, maybe. Blinking. Five just gonna run into the back of the 21. Still got some guys bouncing uh, off each other.
Not too much going on right now mid-race, though. We had those long runs, so I guess that's, uh, you know, mostly what we're getting here are just wall hits. I want to see what brought out the late caution like with like 91 we were 91 laps in or something like that like we were just about to finish this thing on the green and uh, we weren't allowed to have that anymore three barely keeping it off the wall maybe barely touching it all right show us something interesting now well, that was kind of interesting but still wall hit <laughs> just watching those guys almost drift it in the corner ahead Thirteen kind of just well, I guess he wasn't in the racing line necessarily. I know people were complaining about him, but you contacted him. He did give the bottom. I mean, he probably should give a little higher, but there's no reason to run right in the back of him either. Oh. What is happening here? That guy's not making the corner at all. Ooh, that's a heavy hit. Moving right along. I know we're getting close to whenever that caution came out. That guy's still just bouncing it off the wall. Alright, this is what it was. Alright. The two battling sub one. On the lead lap. And then this guy just doesn't turn in for the corner. Wrecks him. So. The two was saying, like, just let him go. I mean, it doesn't look all that faster to me. Looks like he was stuck behind him for a while and couldn't get past him. So if you're not able to make the pass fast, no reason to even slow someone else down for no reason. He's still several laps down at this point. So I don't get that. Sure, it was the 22's mistake that caused the wreck. But I don't agree that he needed to be just let go there, necessarily. So we'll get back to where we were. It's this wreck. Unfortunately, kind of mucked up the finish. We got contact on pit road. Yep, 10 just kind of turns down into the 14. We still would have been fine. We would have had a fine finish, probably fourth or something, if this one just would have went to the end, but what happens? 26 can't hold the line still. But this is not your caution. What is the caution then? Not that. Not that. Hmm. Eight can't hold a line, and then horrible net code. Hmm. <sighs> so that also stops us from having ourselves a decent finish. Then the final restart, Guy Head just gets a horrible jump, and we're just stuck behind him, losing all kinds of spots below us. This guy still doesn't want to slow down for the corner. Like, what is this? Are we wall riding at Phoenix now? Like, that's like the fourth, fifth time I've seen this guy do that. You see, they're three wide ahead of me, running into each other. 25. Yep, that was going to work at any point. 
bouncing off of each other, racking up ahead. What happened here? So we're three wide. I knew it, so I was given all that room. 17 could have come up a little bit higher, but he might not have known that. I think the 7 comes up too high if they're going to be 3 wide. So it gets the 17, and then the 16 gets in the back of him. People caught up in that, but we're white flag now. And the 7 gets me, and then that hooks the 8. Unfortunate, but obviously, I mean, I got hit. I was in my lane, just about as close to the wall as I can be. I don't really buy the, I don't have triple monitors, that's why it happened excuse, because again, I don't have them either, but I do accept his apology, it was obviously an accident. I appreciate this 12 for not doing something really dumb. So he looks like he's thinking about just diving it in on me, and you know what, he actually decided to get me off exit and it worked so shout out to him he earned that spot and he easily could have just shoved me out of the way like everybody else was doing to everybody else and he earned that spot so you know what good job to him I'm glad uh, he had he did nice because I don't remember seeing him doing much during the incidents either so we get eighth that's okay we uh, definitely had a top four car I think but green white checkered's gonna green white checkered I guess and it uh, could have been worse, so I'll take it, I guess. P8, the number one gets the win, not too surprisingly. We, uh, we were going to beat him if that went green to the end, probably. But that's okay. That'll do it for Phoenix. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time.